Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> my name is Margarita and I have my friend Sarah here with me today. Hi. We just got back from the library so we thought we would bring you a library book haul and we're just going to get into it. So should I start or do you want to start? You start. I'll start. So the first book I have to talk about, she almost I'm hit very me for. Excited. <laughs> Um, and that is um, Middle Game by Shannon McGuire, and this is her newest book, and it just sounds so absolutely amazing. It's about these this twin brother and sister who someone's trying to make them, like, become gods, I think. I don't know. I don't need to know a lot. I just know that I love Shannon McGuire. <laughs> so when I saw this, I immediately made a weird face and a weird noise and grabbed it. So, yay. This is the first one. My first book is Dig by A.S. King. This is about Don't Know, um, <laughs> a group of five teenagers whose parents got rich by making money somehow. They were potato diggers, now they're not. And then they get stuck in a maze. I don't know the connection, but there is a connection. Mm -hmm. I got the book because mm -hmm. I'm book two with on. Or Reading rush. <laughs> wow, way to, way to mess it up. <laughs> um, on the reading sprints, I talked to A.S. King a lot, so then I felt like maybe I should read one of her books, because I just talked a lot to her, and she's a really famous author, so that would be pretty cool to actually read one of her books. So yeah, I'll be reading this. Nice. The next book I have to talk about is Wondersmith, The Calling of Morgan Crow, and this is by Jessica Townsend, and this is the second book, I guess, in her... Morgan Crow series. Basically, Sarah picked this up and told me I had to read it. So I said, okay, I like, I really liked the first one. I'm excited to see what happens in the second one. Can't say too much because it is the sequel, but needless to say, I'm super duper excited. Although Sarah worried me because she said that it was a five-star book until the last four pages. So I'm excited to see what I think of the last four pages of the book. So yeah. Just one little aspect. Just one. Okay. The next book that I have to talk about is The Care and Feeding of Ravenously Hungry Girls by Anissa Gray. This book is about three sisters and then one of the sisters, oh they're really prestigious and like up there in their community, and one of the sisters and her husband get arrested so nobody really knows what happened or like what the consequences of that are so the two younger sisters then have to watch the older sister's children and it's kind of navigating through that issue. So, seems cool. Mm -hmm. well, it'll be good. Mm -hmm. The next book I have to talk about is Mouthful of Verve by Samantha Schweblin. Schweblin? Schweblin? I'm sorry, I can't pronounce that. <laughs> but this is basically a short story collection and that's all I know. I, I don't need to know a lot. I'll tell you what I think about it during my wrap-up. But this cover is absolutely stunning, and it's relatively short, so it should be great for um, a readathon because I'm taking I'm taking care of. I'm participating in the newts, and I believe one of the prompts is to read a short story collection. So this will work for that. It's convenient. It is. Good job. I did not plan that. <laughs> the next book I have to talk about is an anonymous girl by who? Greer mm -hmm. Hendricks and Sarah Heckenden? Who knows these names? But this is the <laughs> book. I know nothing about it besides that it is a mystery and that I've watched a lot of videos about it and people really liking it. So I saw it at the library and I said, sure, mm -hmm. I'll learn what it's about when I read it. There you go. And I'm pretty good with that. Yeah, you don't want to know too much going into mystery mm -hmm. novels. That's how you ruin the book. Yeah. The next book that I have to talk about is The Bride Test by Helen Huang. This is, I guess, the sequel or companion novel to The Kiss Quotient. And this is about one of the main characters from The Kiss Quotient. Her, or er, his mom orders him, I guess, a mail order bride from, I think she's from Taiwan? I forget. She's from somewhere. Vietnam. Vietnam. Thank you. I was looking down here. I couldn't find it. <laughs> She's from Vietnam. So it's about their love story. I hear that there's some conflicting views about this because of a lie that's told, but I'm still very interested in reading it. And my next book is The Assassination of Dragwayne Spurg 
by M.T. Anderson and Eugene Yelchin. All I know about, I really don't know much about this book either. I know it's about, I think, a goblin world and an elf in it, or an elf world and a goblin in it, and mm -hmm. an assassination, and a whole bunch of mischief. And yet again, I saw this on BookTube, and I thought it looked really cool. I knew a lot more about it when I originally watched the video <laughs> that this book was in, and that was like, what, eight months ago? Maybe more? Yeah. So, don't remember, but knew I was really excited about it before, so we're going to try it out. There you go. The next book that I have to talk about, we both actually got a copy of, and that is Aquacorn Cove by Katie O'Neill. I have wanted to read this for a really long time, and I saw a copy, so I just picked it up. And then when I saw the second copy, I just handed it to Sarah. I was like, you're going to read it. I don't care what you say. And I'm just really excited because this is about aquacorns and saving the planet and, like, the ocean. And, like, who doesn't want that? I'm pretty artwork. Yeah. Katie O'Neill. looking at artwork. Katie O'Neill's art is stunning. I will read anything that she puts out. I think that she has another book coming out next year. And it's called Dewdrop. And, like, the art already looks Aww. amazing. Anything she puts out, I will read. <laughs> just, just know that. Okay, and last but not least, we both got books by the same author. They're different. We don't know what they're about. They're graphic novels. I got Lewis Undercover. And she got Jane, the Fox, and me. And they are by Fanny Britt and Isabel Ars Arsenault. Is it for you too? Yep. Yes. So they're by <laughs> the same people and they're just beautiful. So what we're going to do is we're going to read them and then swap so that we know what they're about. I, I don't know. I'm assuming this is the Jane one is about Jane Eyre, if I remember correctly. No idea what this one is about. But I'm excited to look at some beautiful artwork and to read a graphic novel. Because who doesn't like graphic novels? So that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's all we have to talk about today. But uh, thank you for joining me, Sarah. You're welcome. And we will see you guys next time. Bye.